Yo, what's good, guys? We're another one today. I'm calling it this railway tunnel, just the, the abandoned railway tunnel. Yeah, it's dead peaceful on the outside. But we are going to go and see what we can find inside the tunnel. The Viking has already gone in, so let's go and check it out. And here we are. Let's go. Some wallies. Oh wow. Just admire this from here. Let's make our way through the tunnel. It's quite boggy in places, so I've got to watch out where I'm walking. Ooh, already slipping. <laughs> I got my torch on me this time. So we'll do what we always do, once through, and then we'll come back. Some bricks over there. So there's a trailer in here that I've seen on the pictures online, which is this here. It used to be a tractor, I believe, as well, but I got told they took it out. Some tiles as well, though. Yeah, the trailer. And this looks like the hay bales here. Still here, just here, that stop us where I took a photo. But yeah, a trailer that's got, it's like a cage on top. Like an animal, an animal trailer, I believe. But yeah, we'll carry on. Walking this way. I'm not sure if you can actually see if it just does, does any justice on the camera. So I think, um, might turn back to the phone like I do with these tunnel ones so you can see a bit more. Let's do that. Here we are on the phone now. I will try and keep it as steady as possible. As you can see, see a bit more even when I go wide angle. So there's not really much to see since that trailer. No graffiti though, which is a good thing. Not that I've seen so far anyway. We'll go around the side, it's a bit boggy. No tracks. You can see where the outline would have been of the tracks. Yeah, I'm just getting a bit blurred for some reason. I'll just stop and try and. <laughs> I don't get why it was getting blurred. You see it is open both ends as well, which is good. And how far we've come. It is a bit bouncy folks, because as I say, no stabiliser like the camera. That's the first one I've seen of them as well, coming up. Oh. Oh. 
yeah, it's nice that there's no graffiti. That's what I'm actually impressed with. And I noticed it is quite high. Quite a big tunnel, as in height-wise. Biking is down in the distance. Another one there. Coming to the end now, not too far away. As I say, I don't know what this place is. I do know the name of it, which I won't say. Um, because I have had it pinned for a while. There's some things to see up here about this of it. Does look like we're coming up to a few things to see. Looks like it's farming equipment. Yeah, looks like farming equipment. Switch back to my camera now. More smoothness for you. It says farming equipment, which I thought it was. We've got some burnt out cabinets. Hay bales. More stuff just over here. Storage or fly tipping. Probably fly tipping. And a bath or if you're parking, a bath. And more hay bales and more farming equipment. Coming to end, just turn my uh, light off. And yeah, that's it for this tunnel. Looks like they kept cattle probably here. Yeah? I don't know where the bike is right off to, but he's disappeared somewhere. <laughs> and the tractor's all the way down here. So the tractor has been moved out of the tunnel, but we just stay it down. <laughs> Let's get it done. <coughs> so it did get took out, but it didn't get took out like people said. And here is the tractor that everybody was on about. Let me grab a look from that side. The tractor. Oh, that was inside. But now it's now. It's out here. And there we go, folks. That is the tunnel. And it's not too bad. Not a bad tunnel, eh? There's the barking.
and we did come across a tractor which people said what well, actually wasn't in the tunnel anymore which it isn't but it's only just down from it so yeah hope you've enjoyed that check out the voidy barking check out the social media on the screen and i'll see you in the next one peace